Nigerian youth clamored for political inclusion, and that gave birth to the not too young to run law. However, it becomes a different kettle of fish when it comes to actual participation in the party primaries. At this experience sharing forum, some of the aspirants explained how they lost out in the battle for party tickets. You have to have money to do politics. You cannot run away from that. Yes, um, the kind of money we're talking about here is not just about the um, form, purchase of form. But if you're, we're talking about sponsorship in terms of, you know, um, logistics. Because we have about 12 wards in my local government, and so we had to be running from, you know, one ward to the other. We had to go to all the nooks and crannies to make sure we get and convince the delegates to, you know, vote for me and all that. After announcing my victory, I feel all the correspondence forms, attestation and the nomination form. It was a day after that, then we saw that list. And all the information we got from the source were not what they told us that the, 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 the list is not from the genuine, they don't know anything about it. I was the only female with two guys from my constituency which both of them asked me to step down for them. And I asked them why. The other one said uh, he has been there for a while. Then the other one said he felt uh, we are all good candidates, but he felt uh, we'll split the vote. So I told him, even if I'm going in for the zero vote, I will, I'm not gonna step down for you because I felt if I'm the only female, you people should be able to step down and leave me because I'm female. According to the Ready to Run group, 1,058 young aspirants indicated interest to seek for political offices, and only 297 purchased nomination and expression of interest forms. However, only 173 of the aspirants emerged as candidates across the political parties. We're providing support to young candidates um, who are running the 2019 election. Some of the support that we're providing, um, we are partnering with Raising New Voices, who is providing um, some funds for young people who are contesting in the 2019 election. We are also providing visibility to young candidates um, using our platform, the Ready to Run platform. Uh, we have um, TV and radio shows where we invite young candidates to come talk about their candidacy, share their manifest. The lessons learned from the party primaries provide an opportunity for young people to understand the intricacies involved in the emergence of political candidates. Hopefully, these lessons will come in handy in subsequent elections. When the news at 10 returns, Central Bank of Nigeria's Monetary Policy Committee shifts its last rate decision meeting for 2018 by one day. That's on Business News. Join us again.